Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I will be filming a spring look today so if you want to see how I created this, please keep on watching. Welcome back to my channel. If it is your first time, my name is Andrea and I create makeup looks and some vlogs on this channel so if you're new to it don't forget to subscribe press the like button and I welcome you to my community so hopefully oh and I have 10 subscribers I am so happy I'm happy for everyone that has subscribed to my channel it means the world to me I didn't think I was gonna have two subscribers so 10 subscribers to me is a big deal okay it's a big deal so I'm super happy my goal is once I get to 500 subscribers I will get my camera so give you guys a better view a better quality a better sound so that is my goal I'm happy and thank you so much for my 10 subscribers you guys are the best let's get to the look all right guys so let's start with hydrating the face I'm gonna use the Tarte drink of H2O I really need this right now. My skin feels so dry lately. I think it's because the weather is changing. We're going from winter to spring. This is um like a more like a watery. It's more like a yeah, it's like a watery feel to it. But once you put it on, it feels so refreshing. It's like nice and cool. It absorbs it right away, so it's not just sitting on your face. I have to use this just when I feel my skin's like super dry. I don't know what's going on. And I drink lots of water, so. Okay, and I'm gonna prime my face with the Frisali Skin Tune. A base product. Oh, I forgot to wet my sponges. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna dab this all over my face all right guys i'm also going to be using the pro the professionals by benefit but i'm only going to use this on the t-zone it's going to use it where the pores are very visible which is my t-zone and this is just going to fill in all of those little pores that you have in your face next i'm going to be doing my eyebrows and i'm going to be using the anastasia beverly hills kit Alright guys, so after I fill them in with the powder, I'm going to go ahead and use the Struck By Bra, and this is by Ardell. And I'm just going to make small strokes going up just to give it the hair effect. Alright guys, now that the eyebrows are done, let's go in with the eyes. I'm going to be using the Just Peachy Mattes Fresh Picked, this color right here. And I'm going to put this all over the lid. Okay, after you have that color down, this is what it's gonna look like. We're gonna go ahead and grab Peach Punch, which is this color right here. It's a little bit more darker. Remember, we are dabbing in, we're not swiping. You get more product when you dab. So, do that, excess off, and we're gonna put that all over uh, the crease area. So, starting from the end of the lid and swiping. We're bringing this color towards the top but not reaching the eyebrow so far enough towards the top but not enough where you're gonna complete the look with the whole um, lid that's why the first color was the whole lid this one is just a little bit up because we're gonna go in with a darker color that we're just gonna stay like on the crease itself so we're sweeping this color a little bit higher than that just sweep 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 all right so now we're gonna grab a peach sangria which is this color right here this is gonna be the the darkest color that we're gonna be using and we're gonna pack this up we're gonna be using this little flat brush here and we're gonna use this on the corner of our eye right here just gonna keep it here we're gonna use it as a V shape I'm gonna pack this on so we're gonna take this here and just the corner of the lid and just pack this up you 
see how this looks right here. We're gonna go take this fluffy brush right here and we can just like fluff everything or buff everything. Take a little bit more of that uh, sangria color and we're gonna put it on the bottom lid of our eye. And we're gonna sweep in an outward motion and let's definitely keep the most intense on the outer part. Don't get scared, it's gonna look better, I promise you. I look like I just went through some major surgery. Mm. Or somebody punched me in the eye. Trust me, it will look better. All right guys, with another flat brush like this right here, this is called Elizabeth Mauve and it's an all over brush. It doesn't have a number, but you take a little brush like this. We are going to spray it just to make it a little wet. And we're going to go with the James Charles palette. Three tone here. And we're going to put that in the outer. I'm sorry. We're going to put that in the inner part of our lower lid. So let's back that. Guys, with the remaining product that I have on my brush, I'm gonna go ahead and take it around, just right here in the corner of the eye, just to give it that pop. I'm gonna do the concealer and the foundation, and then I'm gonna go again and I'm gonna put that on top, just so I don't lose any color that I have on. I'm gonna soften the outer part of this look. I'm gonna grab a from the uh, Too Faced palette, I'm gonna grab the Peach Meringue and just on top, just to soften it up a little bit. I'm gonna use the Stila Waterproof Stay All Day Liner. This is a marker and I'm going to line my eyes. Eyeliner done. And I'm gonna take the NYX's Black Pencil and I'm going to do the, the lower lid. So I bought new lashes and I got this from House of Lashes. It's the first time I purchased um, lashes from House of Lashes and I love them. The quality is so good. Um, I'm testing out new lashes and I also ordered this little case here. This is for your lashes. And it's so cute. But you open it and you can put your eyelashes in here. It keeps them nice and um, protected it also came with house of lashes glue which i think it was pretty cute and the whole thing was like 35 dollars, including with a pair of lashes so it was the pair of lashes the glue and the case and it was 35 dollars. and i needed a little case to put my lashes in so i said hey why not the best part of all of this is that the mirror has light i mean how cute is that i loved it so you protect your lashes it has a little it's like an undergo you carry this with you wherever you go it protects it the mirror is really good too so you could use it while you put on your lashes and it protects and i like it so much it's so cute i'm so happy so i thought of sharing it with you guys so i'm gonna go ahead and put the lashes on i'm going to use the house of lashes i'm gonna pop those on and i will be right back all right guys eyeliner and lashes are on let's move on to the rest of the face i'm going to use the elf 16 hour concealer you know you guys know i love this stuff it is a great product it covers everything but you have to be quick with the product because Yes, guys, like I was saying, you have to be quick with this product. Once you put it on your face, you have to dab quickly. If not, it will um, stay stained on your face. I'm putting concealer on before the foundation just because I want um, coverage. And then I'm going to, once I put the foundation on, I'm going to go ahead and put more concealer on. Because I need to cover these dark circles. All right guys, I'm gonna take the Peach Perfect Foundation and I'm gonna put that all over my face. I'm gonna squeeze some on here. Just dab it everywhere. I 
just did a makeup look in Spanish. A fun video, I liked it a lot. Link the video so you guys can see it, go check it out. I'm gonna put a little bit more of concealer again on the spots that I want more coverage in. Dab that and I'll be back. All right guys, so I put the concealer and the foundation um, everywhere. I'm gonna grab a little bit again of that pink and I'm gonna go to over again on the corner of my eye and a little bit under just so I didn't lose any product. Just making sure that everything's still there. I'm gonna grab some mascara. This is the Benefit Roller Lash. I'm just gonna put it on my lower lashes. Now I'm gonna grab the BH Cosmetic. This is the uh, con contour and blush. And I'm going to grab this dark color here, angle brush. I'm gonna grab just a little bit. This is a very tense um, powder. And you just, from the, you start from here, down halfway. So, do this. So aligning the top of the ear, halfway. For the nose, we are going to take a little brush like this, flat, and with that same color, just, just try to make a line right on top of the bridge of my nose. Once you created that line, Before or this one, we're just gonna take a little more here and then we're just gonna blend that out. Right, I'm gonna grab the Laura Mercier and this is a color addiction. This is the face illuminator, so we're just gonna highlight points of our face and with our finger, just gonna grab some, put it in the tip of our nose like this. Just a little bit, the bridge of her nose, side of her face, just to give it a, a glow. Let's create a C shape. C shape. C. On the cupid's bow, tip of her lip, chin. And move on over the lips. NYX lip liner, and this is in color ever. I'm gonna be laying up my lips. And I'm going to take Boxum lip gloss, and this is in color Erica. It is a pinkish lip gloss. And I'm gonna put it all over my lips. Guys, I forgot one thing. How am I gonna forget? The blush. Got the blush. Let's go in again with the um BH. And we're gonna put blush. I need something that's missing. Let's grab this color right here. This is a more peachy look. So let's dab that and let's put this here on top of our contour. A rosy, it's like a rosy color. It goes with our look. And let's just set our face with the spray. And let's have the spray. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. That is it for this look. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you again for watching. I hope to see you next time.